last time on Bound S and B. Last we saw Rune, he was mulling about his workshop, seeming a bit lost in what to do with himself, feeling a little bit alone, and came up with the idea to build himself a friend. <laughs> one that couldn't leave him, one that he could fix if it broke, and one to help keep him safe. And he ended up going and getting uh, Sylph in the middle of the night, just running up to them, banging on their door, except they were awake and fishing. And the two of them spent the next several days building Gizmo, the robot dog, <laughs> who eventually at the last minute when they just didn't think it was going to work, got a little pat on the head and seemed to just come to life. And now we have little Gizmo. <laughs> mm-hmm. Hee hee hee. Uh, he made Gizmo, and that was pretty great. Immediately showing Aaron and Bass and anyone else who was around, and not on my stream, but at some point after that, uh, there was the race between Sylph and Ash, where Rune was in attendance. And the two of them, Rune and um, Vast, headed on over there. Rune got purchased a foam wing. <laughs> and it seemed like, as far as Rune knew, everything went okay. A little bit rocky at the end, but he's not quite aware of what might have happened during that. So, I think with that we can go and get into things, yeah? I'm gonna swap our song. I'm gonna turn the music down a little bit, tell it to be less aggressive, but... Let's get into lore, yeah? <gasps> okay. <laughs> what? What do we need to do? I need to make more of the red berm, of course, because I only have like one left. And I don't really know how I only have one left, but I should make more. Probably should get armor, I guess. I've been really putting that off. I should sell crops for more emeralds so that I can buy things for Vast if we have another sporting event. That would be good, because then, because then I can buy them a gift. That's partnery. I it'd be nice. Hi, 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 everyone. Um, but I should really return the wing first because I, I didn't I don't know how I ended up with the ash one But I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to have that because I didn't pay for it. So I should probably go take it back Hi, hi you Hi you Little friend <laughs> Do you want to come with me? I'm gonna go on a bit of a walk We're gonna go take this back and then maybe we'll come back and do some farming <laughs> Mm-hmm. Come on I'll see if we have any emeralds to take with us just in case we see any any good books. Oh, we've got plenty. <laughs> Let's take Gizmo on a bit of a bit of a walk around. That should do as well. Can make more noises now. Right now we've got bark and whine and growl. Can't really think of any any other ones. Oh, it's just oh, it's just dark out. I'm gonna go honk you, Gizmo. Don't mind me. I don't really know what else he would need to make. <laughs> we awaken. How are you feeling after the walk and stuff? I'm, I'm all right. Um, my head hurts sometimes, and that's not very fun. But for the most part, I've, I've mostly recovered. I've got um, scratch. <laughs> mhm. Mm we awakened. <laughs> Good morning. Happy noises. That's true. I guess the bark is kind of an alert. Come on, bud. <laughs> he's so cute. You are delightful. Um. So he's got kind of the bark, which is more of, a, more of an alerting one. We've got how? Ooh. That's a good one to know. Yeah, I probably should, I can write that down. Uh, we're going to go all the way to the back of the book, and we're just going to do bits for Gizmo. Upgrades for him. Gizmo, don't go too far. Oh, Gizmo. How? You should make noise canceling if you want. That'd be... Small, actually. I wonder if that would be really healthy, really helpful. Happy noises, vaguely. Vague, vaguely happy noises. <laughs> something, something happy noises. Whatever that might mean. You coming to what? I think he should our woo though. That that's a really good one. I should, I could program him to have an our woo. He deserves to have more options, of course. Oh, all well, the birds are still in here. Hmm, I guess it just was yesterday. I haven't gotten to talk to Sylph yet. They've been they've been in the room. Up in the house. Alright, let's return this. Oh. I don't like that there's just a perfect Oh, okay, well, it's just gonna go up there. Darn it. 
Oh, this is all... Well, that's fine. I can do nothing about that. Gizmo? Oh, hi, where are you going? What are you doing? Come on, let's go do some trading. <laughs> oh, I don't know if I should do something about that. I don't know if I can. Look at the kiwi. <laughs> He's so small. I don't know if I can do anything about that one. I think that's just gotta be that way. It's unfortunate, but you know. Enjoying the view. It's um it's a lovely view. I'm just gonna walk away. Let's go let's go do some trading. Let's get over to the village. Oh, I don't know. I don't know if they're having a good time, but I don't know if I can free them from it. Oh, Gizmo, get up you look close to the edge there, bud. Alright. Now. I think we start with some books for armor pieces. I've got pretty much not- we need to get mending on these. That would actually be great. We should make our, our shoes better. Guess we want to come on in. Maybe. Maybe not. Okay, you're probably- oh no! How did you- how'd you do that? How- oh no. Alright, well. You want to hang out with the unbreaking one? Alright, that- that's- that's alright. You can hang out with him. I'm sure he- I'm sure he won't mind if you just- Stand in his presence. Get him a friend. I think I'm okay. Gizmo was very hard to make. I don't know if I can make like two. Uh, I, I, pro I can probably make another one, but like, I don't know. I'm, I'm his friend. That's the point. I'm, I'm his friend. And you know, there's there's like a horse. We've got so many other creatures. Is your feather falling better than mine? No, it's not. That's not this one. Okay, we need. Oh, Gizmo, no, please. Gizmo, don't terrorize them. A parachute, Gizmo. I think we should make a parachute for me. <laughs> that might be something of note. Doing a parachute. Oh, I've got mending. What else should we put on these boots? Mending. Mm. Sharpness. What else we have? Sleeping edge. Could be his friends. I feel like in my heart, Gizmo can in fact see you all. We'd possible to enchant Gizmo. <gasps> I don't know. I mean. That sounds like a great idea. I don't know if I can. I don't even know how that would work. Okay. That's going to be good for that. That's mostly what I think we need for the shoes, is, is the fella falling. Um, I guess I'm threatening them so they keep better prices. Yeah, I think so. That one, that one was real low. Okay. We could probably go and get more things. Power, looting, projectile, projection, feather falling, efficiency. That's more for tools. Okay, do you guys think I should make, like, not not an iron sword or armor? I should, I should probably do armor, right, you know? Gonna <laughs> give me a new Pokemon. <laughs> I'm gonna start with more breaking books. Because if we're doing armor, we should have a couple of that. Do we have protection? That'd be important to have. No? This is upsetting. I'll have to do that. Power, looting, projectile protection. I not projectile, blast protection. I Creepers. We should have at least one item with projectile protection, actually. I almost going to give him a track record. Hey, I'm plenty safe um, most of the time. Like like most of the time, I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty safe. What do you have? Hmm. Okay, that's upset. I guess we can have like a, a helmet that has aqua affinity. That'd be fun. And then I'll, I'll grab one of these blast protections because that just feels important with the creepers. And then the rest of it can be... Oh. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. Oh, uh, uh, sorry. I had to turn you down with my headphones. <laughs> oh, sorry. No, you're all right. Hi, Apple. Oh, wait, it's been so long since I've seen you. Hi. Uh, yeah, I've been, um... I've been a little under the weather for the past couple of weeks. Oh no. Are you alright? Yeah, I'm better now. Mm. That's good. <laughs> Hi. Decided to, mm -hmm. decided to do a little exploring. Oh, like checking around town? Uh-huh. That's amazing. <gasps> Wait, do you ever see, you ever see my dog? <gasps> oh! G Gizmo, don't run around. <laughs> Gizmo, come here. Hello? Hey, go sit. This is Gizmo. Oh, my He's my dog. Goodness. I made him. Yes, you this made is, him? I made him. Me and Sylph. Uh, the hummingbird lives just up there on the tree. Um, oh. Gizmo, apple, apple, gizmo. <laughs> uh, 
He balks and everything. <laughs> I have some bad news for you. Uh, that's surprising. I, uh, we just interacted. That feels that feels a bit a bit of a jump. Um, I might have I might have I might have lied to you about my name. It's not Apple. My name's Cozy. Oh. Oh, that's that's all. That's fair. That's fair. I figured Apple felt Apple felt like a nickname, but it also felt like it could be a name. So I just kind of let it happen. But I also only met you once, so that's that's fair. That's all right. I was just uh, I was a little nervous about meeting so many new people at once, oh. and by so many I meant two. <laughs> <laughs> by so many, I mean two. Uh huh. That's that's all right. Well, how about this? We can start over. It's nice to meet you, Cozy. My name is Rune. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> and this is Gizmo. He is a good boy. Would you like to give him a treat? Please. You can eat these. Eat's a strong word. He absorbs them, but close enough. Oh, <laughs> oh that's so cute. <laughs> he's, oh, he's, that's he's, adorable. He's, he's, he's such a little lad. He tramples around, and he's great. He can he can do boxing things and oh, spins. Apparently, spinning. I didn't teach him that. He's a learning. He's learning. He can bark, and if he there he goes. <laughs> So cute. Oh, I didn't know he could spin. That's a new one. He's he's developing. He's developing new skills every day. He's growing. <laughs> oh, I absolutely adore him. <laughs> he's he's a good boy. I just made him like a couple days ago, actually. So he's he's pretty new to the world. He's a newborn. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're right. Is he's just a baby? Puppy. He's just a puppy. baby. He's just a big puppy. He's only a dog size because I made him big, but he's just a baby. He's just mm -hmm. a wee bab. That's all you are. He's a wee just bab. a few days old. He's just, he's not even, a, I don't even know if it's been a week. He's just a baby. Oh, <laughs> oh I absolutely love him. <laughs> well, it's great to see you around. Have, have you, you have, I don't know if you've been to my house or anything. Oh. Uh, uh, I haven't been a lot of places. I have been very sick. That's... I would, I did kind of like, contain myself in my house that way I mm -hmm. wouldn't get anyone else sick. Oh, that's 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 very fair. That's very fair. I, I could show you if you like, if you're up for a little a little walk around tour, it's just over there. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Come on, Gizmo. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't know if you actually stuck around, but I'm I'm really glad you're still here. Yeah, I just I even though like I said, not I glad sick. that you've been not feeling well. That's not very good. But I'm glad you're feeling better. <laughs> Just Gizmo walking alongside of you was really cute. Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh. oh no. Oh, he hello, sir. He decided he didn't want to go on the- Oh! <laughs> the uh. he, he made eye contact with you. It was a bit aggressive. It's okay, Gizmo can kind of teleport. Oh. I can also- I I, I think I- I made this staff, right? And it, this staff lets me teleport, like, like, um, like that. Like, I go noom in, in whichever direction. He also developed teleportation, and I think I put a little bit of an ender eye in them, and I didn't—I don't know where in the system it is. But if you shake him, you can kind of hear it rattling around. So I, I don't know. If, I feel like I should just leave it. I don't think I would want to shake him. I just just a little bit here. I can pick him up. Come here. Come, no. No, come here. Come here. Gizmo. Giz. Don't be. <laughs> no, he's running. Why are you running? Mickey doesn't want to be picked up. <laughs> Makes him feel silly. Come here. <laughs> oh my. He feels a little bit silly if I pick him up. What? Well, well, he he's so he's so fun size. Look at him. Look at him. Oh, he's all he's sad. So cute. He's so sad. <laughs> Can't be mad at this. Look at this. It's adorable. It's adorable. He 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 knows he has a pickup function. It's like the bath, but like this is it. <laughs> <laughs> like you scrub a cat. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> it's like scrubbing a cat. He just doesn't like it. Okay, this is mine. Uh, I live here with uh, oh. not not just me. I live here with Ava, who's my root sister, basically sister. Um, we've known each other like our whole lives. But it's my horse. His name is Barnaby. I have a brother. <gasps> oh, are they around here? Barnaby. Uh, or just a brother in general? Um, uh, a brother in general. He's back at home right now. Mm. That's cool. That's nice. I don't actually have any siblings by by blood necessarily, but but Ava's. Basically, <laughs> mm -hmm. you know, you know, when you, when you stick around someone long enough, <laughs> they get the title. I'm, um, uh, I went that way. Me and my brother are that way with our uncle. Hmm. Yeah. He's not 
technically our uncle by blood. Mm -hmm. Um, but he, he more or less raised us, so we call him our uncle. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, I'm glad that they were able to help you out and raise you, and you got mm -hmm. a good uncle figure. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sometimes, sometimes you find family that's not exactly related, and it works out better, I think. Mm -hmm. Oh, when did you get in here? <laughs> I, I, I saw the door close, no, the door closed, and he was not inside that I saw. I definitely saw him enter. Okay, I didn't see it happen. I just thought he just looked at me like, hello, I teleported again. <laughs> well, this is mine. Um, this is kind of my kitchen area. And then I don't I don't come in here because I'm really bad at baking. I'm really bad at cooking. I don't really do food. Um, mm -hmm. uh, I'm on batch. What was it? 74. It was 73 before. Now it's 74 of cookies. They're oh. bad. They're pretty bad. I, I mean, it can't be worse than my uncle. Can I try one? Yeah, let me see. Let me see if I've got one of mine. Are you sure you want to have this, though? I mean, it's not... Alright. I I used regular chocolate chips this time, so, like, we're doing... Oh, you gotta run around? <laughs> you just gotta do some sprinting. <laughs> Start going around and... So 74. Gotta, okay, so I, I've been bit. really working on it. It's what I do late at night when I can't sleep and I can't really invent because they was like, get out of the workshop and, and then I need something to do and I'm and I'm trying to, I'm, I'm going to do them right because then one day I could make them for vast if I do them well. What do you think? I like it. Oh. It, wait, it's good. Is it like edible? Uh, is it like... I think it is. 74 might be it. Oh, was there anything you want to change? You think it's changed? Too crunchy, too soft. I use, uh, I use, a, I, use, I tried to follow all of the normal ingredients this time, all of the normal um, ones. Did you use salt? Just a tiny bit, but only like a tiny bit. I think you could do with a little bit more salt. Oh, I accidentally had one batch that was just all salt, no sugar, uh, and that one was pretty bad. So I, I've been, I've been really sparing. I think I put like a whole two grains. I'm just really nervous about it. There was one batch that didn't have any flour in it. There was one oh. that was a lot of water involved, so those were really soggy. Um, uh, <laughs> there was I wish one... I was here to try those. The soggy ones? Yeah. <laughs> Why would you want to try the soggy ones? I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> they seem like they would be a fun texture. Okay, well this is a wonderful improvement that they are actually edible and they're not bad. Okay, this is wonderful. I'm gonna know. I've got. I've got hold on, I've got to write this down. The 74 is the closest we've gotten to success. The cookie trials is what we'll call it. You very carefully. Trials. You very carefully. You make them soggy. All right. Okay, number 74. <laughs> Best yet. Cozy approved. Wonderful. Wonderful. Good to know. Good to know. Good to know. Okay, cool. This is this is wonderful because my my goal is to make it so Ava thinks they're edible, and then by that part, then I know they're good, and then then I can give them the vast, and then it'll be great. So it's a, mm -hmm, it's, a, it's, mm -hmm. a it's a three step plan, <laughs> foolproof <laughs> even. But um, yeah, we'll go downstairs first. Yes, we can just stay okay. up here. This is kind of uh, secret staircase. <laughs> it is a bit hidden. It's mostly just kind of storage and, and potions and things, and then... This is your storage room? Yeah, I've... Uh, it's bigger wanted... than my entire house. Oh! <laughs> okay, well listen. I really thought it'd be best to have a chest for most every item. Ah, you know. And, and, then, and then we just kind of went for it. And then there's the... The enchanting area, which matter of fact, let me put these books away real quick, because I, I went shopping. I went very much shopping and bought many, many books. Boop. Uh, these are just a lot of this aqua infinity. I don't even Do I have an aqua infinity spot? That'd be smart. No? That's upsetting. Unbreaking. Where do you go? There. I don't have enough spots. Blast protection. Mm, you're gonna go there. Wonderful. <laughs> don't mind me. We're doing, we're doing book things. But. And then over here is my workshop. Um, it's just why I just do my walking and things. That's why I make all my contraptions and my, my, my things like my grappling hook. Whoa. I don't think you actually saw me do that just now, but I did do a really cool jump. Oh. Whoa. 
Ah. Yeah, that was love too. I'm pretty sure by Evan. Just boop. Just boop. You know. You know, like you do. Mm -hmm. hmm. And this is this is what Gizmo gets charged at. This is his little charging station. He sits right here, and then he gets all oh. gets all powered up to go. That's cool. Hmm. Have you ever seen a TV? A what? Exactly. Come with me. <laughs> oh, do I have something wonderful to show you? So upstairs is kind of mostly bedrooms. I don't really sleep up there because I don't sleep very often, but I have one in here. Also, all the anvils. Please admire them. Oh. Lovely. Oh. Mm hmm But up here is the TV. <laughs> if you want to come watch TV. <laughs> how is... How is that... How is that picture moving? I'm just that good. I'm, I'm, I'm a really good inventor. I'm really good at it. I'm just amazing at it. <laughs> I I can't look away. <laughs> I know it entraps it keeps you going, right? It's very hard to change the channel, but when you do it's like a whole new thing. Before we had bird we had a bird dancing, he was he was a rainbow, it was great. I'm thinking if you I can get a magpie on there. The picture? I kinda it takes a lot of effort though. I can't I, I have to like reprogram it. I'm thinking about putting a magpie on there one day or, or like another kind of bird just go cycling through them. But or maybe like a bee. You know, it's great. Well, this is this is this show right now. It's been kind of a fan favorite, fan favorite in the household. <laughs> I wish I had moves like that. I know, right? Me too. I can't dance for anything. <laughs> Maybe I just want to share my TV. <laughs> I can only do like ballroom dances. Oh, so wait, you those know those are only fun occasionally. You know ballroom dances? Yeah. I don't know ballroom dances. I kind of had to learn them. Oh. That's cool. That's a that's really interesting that you know how to ballroom dance. Uh, do I... most people not know how to ballroom dance? Uh, I certainly don't. Then again, I didn't really do much dancing at all when I was little. I was pretty sick and weak most of my childhood, so I don't think mm. I could have learned to ballroom dance had I even been asked to. Oh. I can't normally I can dance. Teach you sometime if you want it. <gasps> That would be really cool. <laughs> I don't know how to dance at all. That'd be nice. I've got like two left feet. I'm really good at inventing, but I don't do as well with like dancing and cooking. You know, those are my <laughs> those are not my strong suits. That'd be really that'd be really nice if you could one so day. So had to learn how to ballroom dance, and our teachers oh, it didn't seem to grasp his learning techniques mm -hmm. so i mostly taught him <laughs> so i've been called him a good teacher when it comes okay. to dancing mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you've got you've got practice mm -hmm. <laughs> well, see now that's that's good that's admirable um i just want to show you that the backyard there's a cow <gasps> oh one, they're just fluffy. So fluffy i know there's so much there's so much fur on that cow i'm just i'm putting my entire face in it's really face. soft and he smells like warm milk. <laughs> I'm kidnapping your cow. Oh, that's that's all right. <laughs> Are you gonna bring him home? You have to give him a good home if you're gonna take him. Like you gotta uh, you gotta build him up like a little house. You've got to. Okay, well I'll come back for him. <laughs> okay, all once right. Once I have that. Okay, once you build him a great house. Uh, <laughs> last little bit over here is the the gazebo area. Normally there's a disc in here. Ooh. There's not anymore, but there's there's normally songs. And a little hammock to sleep in. But it's nice. Ava just really went ham with this one and just said, I'm going to make a pretty gazebo. And I said, go for it. <laughs> I absolutely love it. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you'd be able to guess this, but my favorite color is pink. <gasps> so I absolutely my love My favorite it color is here. also pink. <laughs> <gasps> oh, gee. <laughs> <laughs> Look at us. It's a good color. That's why I, that's why most of the house is pink. The blue is for Ava, but the, the pink is all me, and I like the cherry trees a lot, and then the petals and all the things. And then I think the last bit's just outside. I've got my my garden area. 
And my bees. You would enjoy the bees. Bees? I don't think I've really got to show everyone my bee area. It's nice. So it's a little I bit funky bees. to get to. You kind of walk along this edge. Oh, okay. But these are the bees. <gasps> they live in here. Oh. And they and they and they're perfect, and I love them. And they they are their house is so cute. Oh, they're so round and friend shaped. They are. Look at them. Look at them go. Their legs are so little. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a big fan of using copper, so I realized I needed to get bees, and then I was like, I should build my big beehive. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're all coming. Oh, they're all going in. Okay, well, <laughs> goodbye, bees. They're probably tired. They probably they work hard, and then down here, is, uh, I guess the gardens. Not really much going on here. Everything. Your of... whole area is so much more ex. Extravagant than mine. Oh. <laughs> um, I don't and you have so many more crops than I have. Oh, do you not have? Do you not have any? Um, which which have, ones do you have? I have wheat, mm -hmm. and I was recently given mm -hmm. uh, some carrots and beetroot seeds. No potatoes. No potatoes. Oh. I could I could bring you some crops because I've got too many. Too many? I, no, no, I mean it. I like I've got the sugarcane over here growing. And the, these barrels, which I, I recently had to empty, there's just so many of every oh. kind. I'm gonna bring you some pumpkin seeds and some melons, because melons are great. You can turn them into like glistening melons, and they taste amazing. Uh huh. And then and then you have wheat, and you have the potatoes are good. I think personally, potatoes are wonderful because you can bake them, make baked potatoes. Beetroots, I'm, I'm not a fan of. I'm not a fan of beetroots. I like that you can make them in to dye. Mm hmm. You know what? That's fair. They do have practical use. Do you have any sugar cane? Uh, no. Now, this farm is not the most efficient, but for, <laughs> for whatever I don't catch, it falls down to the mud. Um, it actually gets picked up by the hoppers. Oh. When I get some better suspensers, it'll, it'll be even better. But for now, you know, it makes its way down here. But I'll bring I'll bring you some sugar cane as well. Um, hmm. Do you know what? I can bring you so many chickens because these guys make so many eggs. It's absolutely ridiculous. Oh, my <laughs> ostrich is over here. He, oh, he's made an egg. I wonder if this is gonna oh. make a child. It oh. did. Oh no! Oh, I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> I thought I didn't know it would work. Oh no! He's made a baby. You're a father now. <laughs> I'm already a father. Oh no! You can also ride these. You're a grandfather now. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Look at him. I didn't. He's so big. God, he's bigger than the chickens. He's so tiny. He's so much. He's so much bird. I didn't intend for that to happen. I'm gonna be honest. I just thought <laughs> I thought it'd be a funny bit, and he would just maybe. I don't know. Well. I think most people who become parents don't really intend for it to happen. <laughs> you know. Yeah, I don't think mine's intended it either. You're right. You're so right. <laughs> okay, last last idea. Do you want any bees? Want bees? Mm -hmm. Do you want any bees in your area? I wouldn't know where to put them. Do you have any trees? Yeah. Do you have flowers? Plenty. Then you've got a place for bees. Oh. Mm -hmm. Let me see if I can grab one of these. Hey, no. You all can't come out of here. Okay, I don't actually know how many are in here, but I can make so many more of these, and I've got too many bees. So I'm just going to grab a couple, and we're going to see who has bees in them. <laughs> all right. Now, if you would, if you want, you can show me where you live. Or I can give you all of these things, and you can go at your own time and, and do it if you don't want to. You showed me your house, so it's only fair that I show you mine too. Okay, I'm up for a little adventure. Can I bring Gizmo? Yeah, of course. Wonderful. Come with me. I would be I would be offended if you didn't bring Gizmo. You know what, time? I would too. We'd all be offended. Gizmo would be the most offended. <laughs> I don't actually yeah, I don't actually know. I know where you live. I uh you know where the bird sanctuary is? Mm-hmm. I think I live just a little bit past that. Oh, okay, that's not far at all. 
Gizmo, are you still here? There he is. Okay, he's teleported again. <laughs> oh, the sparks are calling me old. I'm not old. I didn't mean to become a grandfather, or I didn't intend for that to happen. You don't have to call me old. <laughs> the cows are fine. Don't look at them too hard. Don't look at those birds you just saw too hard either. Just look away. <laughs> They were part of the race yesterday, and then I I don't know what their life is right now. I'm just gonna leave them. Gizmo, there you are. Yeah, I went by there. It was very loud, and I was confused up until I realized it was a race mm -hmm. of some sort. Yeah, yesterday, Sylph and Ash. Um, Sylph's a hummingbird, and Ash is a roadrunner. Um, so they had a race to see who's the fastest. <laughs> so it was oh. it was a couple of us, and then also the birds came. They brought. They also rolled up to to the to the party trying to think of the best way to get up here. Oh, do you need to go up or do you need to go around? We need to go up. Oh, I can do up. I failed at doing up. There we go. <laughs> Gizmo. There you are. <laughs> if there's one thing I can do, it is up. <laughs> oh! Here we are. <gasps> oh. oh, this is so... This is such a lovely little spot. We've got a vine. Ouch! Oh. I didn't. I didn't do the vine well. Um, I said ouch before I hit the ground too. I didn't even. <laughs> I didn't even... It was an ouch at the impending <laughs> pain. Like the idea of a pain. I'm gonna put down the bees <laughs> to see if they're gonna. I'm just gonna free them all. There they go. They're all gonna be there, and they're gonna go <laughs> wherever they feel like. <laughs> but yeah, this, this is, is my lovely. Little house area. I've been slowly. Uh... Making it more of a home. It's really nice. Ooh. Ooh, I like the moss. Ooh. Oh, it's delightful. Oh, look at the bells up there. That's so handy. Oh, Gizmo. <laughs> you just can't trample people's beds. I know, trapdoors are very concerning. Every, everyone, everyone knows. It. Do you want me to open them for you? He did not want me to open them for him. He wanted to stay like that. All right. <laughs> But this is that, this is adorable. To make it seem bigger in here. Mhm. Mm I like it. I like it a lot. Here's the thing. My house was was like a quarter of this much room before, and then I got I got bullied because specifically Ava wanted more room, <laughs> <laughs> and then I needed a workshop. So then if, if I got a workshop, then we needed to have a house. Um, because I wasn't allowed to have a workshop if there was a house. I don't know if he wants to go outside or if he just really likes trapdoors. <laughs> All right, bud. But I like your area. This is really cute. If you want, we can plant all these extra crops I brought. Uh, sure. Let me, um... I actually, I realize I don't have a hoe, so if you have any wood, I can make a hoe to help. Oh, I have one. Yeah, wonderful. <laughs> all right. I've got potatoes and melons and uh, all the things. I can put the melons on the edge so that they'll like not hurt anything. Mm -hmm. uh, I also have a water bucket so if we need to make more... Ooh, okay. Boom. Maybe a potato there. Alright. Gizmo, you don't have to trample the crops. I'm doing. <laughs> Thank you, Gizmo. You're so helpful. Mm -hmm. There we go. There we are. And once everything's grown, I can probably redistribute it in a better way. <laughs> and make it neat and not just kind of... It's kind of like wild, wild crops right now. You know, just kind of growing however they feel. Yeah, best. I wanted it to be... The, this little pond was already here when I showed mm -hmm. up. So I wanted it to just feel oh, kind no. of natural around. Oh no. You're oh singing. no. <laughs> <laughs> I just let it happen. It was just kind of sad. <laughs> it was just so anticlimactic how it was going. It was just like, oh no. There I go. Oh, but mommy, I'm what? just sleeping through the day. Oh, have you not seen an ender chest before? No. They're pretty cool. It's all sparkly. Mm-hmm. 
it's very nice. You can you use like the ender eyes to make them from the from the endermen. Oh. Mm -hmm. They're really interesting because they're all connected. So it's it's um, using like blaze essence, like the the the, the reddish yellow um, powder that comes from them, mixed with an eye, and then surrounded by obsidian, which is water and lava. But these are all connected. So I have one here, and I have one back at my house. So I'm putting something here. I put something in it. I can pick it up with whatever is in there, and it's different for everyone. So your ender chest will have your own things, and if you open this so chest, so you can't see the egg I just put in there. I can't see an egg in there, and you can't see that I've got a camera in here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and then in there, you can't see that I have like three things of coffee in here. Oh, what's coffee? I also made that. Oh! <laughs> right, right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I feel so much mm -hmm. more energy so than fast. I felt before. <laughs> so fast. Speed. Truly. Just all of it. It's great, isn't it? Too much though. No, but I'm hoping it's too crazy. <laughs> uh, but it's great. You can go new. <laughs> Are you still not feeling as well? I probably shouldn't have given you coffee if you're still feeling oh, sick. It, it, it's it's not that. I'm just having a. I'm having a bad like, fat pain day, I guess. No, oh. your arm. Um, mm -hmm. where the yeah. arm would be. I, I I know that feeling, almost like pins and needles, but not quite. Wanting to move it, but then it, it's nothing really there. It's not fun. <laughs> you, you understand? I do. I. Yeah, it probably makes more sense if I show you. I think it was one of the reasons I was so excited to see you the first day because, I don't know, I've never really met anyone else. Uh, like me? Oh. So, I, uh, also don't have an arm. <laughs> it's a made one. This is all metal and things. I'm a bit of an inventor. But I, I know what random pain feels like, and I know how it feels to have something that was there once but isn't there anymore, or... Feels like it should be because the body wants to be balanced and equilibrium and all that, and it's just not. Some <laughs> days it feels worse than others, or nightmares and things will make it more prevalent, or just random. Mm -hmm. But, but I, I, I do know. <laughs> the only other person who's understood um, is uh, is my brother. Yeah. Yeah. That's fair. I don't think I've ever met anyone else. I mean, I'm aware of other people who have no wings, and that's one thing. But for me, I've never had them, so I can't really mourn the loss. Um, I can just look on and, I don't know, envy for not having that bit. This is different. Everyone else has two. And I once had more than one. <laughs> I once had two arms. And for a while I had one arm and I didn't even have this one that I made, so... Mm -hmm. I absolutely know what it's like. And I was actually... I don't know. I, I'm not excited that you also don't have an arm, but more so, <laughs> I don't know, someone else who understands. It's not, it's not excitement in the fact that you're glad I'm missing it. It's <laughs> excitement in the fact that you're glad you're not alone. Yeah. That's exactly it. <laughs> In a way, we're, we're kind of more alike than I, than I previously thought. <laughs> oh, cozy. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. You're... It, it's so cool. Because <laughs> well, you're standing in the way. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. It you're took... also cool, Kizmo. <laughs> it took a very long time to get right. Mm -hmm. Years upon years. Is it, is it like, 
how the cookies are at multiple trials. Oh, so many. You know, arguably, harder than the cookies. I know, I know. It was really? more than 74 attempts. <laughs> oh, wow. It was mostly 100? that, probably around, I stopped counting after a bit. It stopped being as many attempts and more so what did I need to do to get it right this time? What did I need to change? What, what did I need to tweak? It started out much more simple. Um, didn't move, it didn't have pressure, didn't have feeling. Um, but eventually it got better and then I healed and then sometimes what I would do would hurt to make it better because I was pretty much doing it all alone. Trying to heal an arm, already kind of hard. Trying to build a new one at the same time, also difficult. <laughs> but it's Gizmo, my my delight, <laughs> my my best boy. But I do believe this working is my true great work. I like. I'm glad you found something to help. Thank you. I'm gonna put my jacket back on because I feel awfully exposed. <laughs> <laughs> or at the very least, my sleeve back on. You know what was also interesting? Making detachable sleeves. That was a fun one because <laughs> I sure realized <laughs> I needed to do that too to be able to access it in case anything went wrong. This one's a great help. He likes bringing me my wrench and things whenever anything is not functioning or needs fine tuning. Aww. <laughs> Now, I do have like four stacks of chickens, so we've. I think we've got. If you've got some wood, oh, I think we've got to make yeah. them a pen, for yeah, sure. Yeah, I can do that. We've got to. <laughs> there's so many eggs. We've got to. They deserve. I can, I can definitely do that. I wonder if I could put. Okay, I, I was gonna put down the sugar king. I cannot because this is moss. But just imagine that it's there. What if I just, what if I just make a, a little, hello gizmo, don't mind me, what if I just, uh, boop. There we go. Where should these chickens go? I made the tiniest pond for the sugar cane. <laughs> oh, delightful. <laughs> just as a little guy. Um, Over hmm. here would be a good spot, but there is not any dirt. Oh, have any dirt do you have inside. any? Or we can get some. I've got one whole dirt on me. I have me. a little bit of dirt. Okay. We can always come back later and get more, more, more dirt going. I don't actually have my tools, so I would have a shovel on me, but that would be too intelligent. <laughs> I can also go on a mission and, and grab more dirt from like around. Yeah, we might do a little. Okay, more dirt mission, dirt mission, we go. I don't actually have a way of getting out of here, so I'm gonna build up and then get back down. Oh, well, you could just go out the entrance. That is so true. Why, am I, why did I specifically need to go that way? <laughs> right over there. I don't know why. I just had to take, like, this alternative route. Okay, <laughs> let's go. Oh, there's, like, a waterfall over here. That's so nice. Hmm. All right, let's... There was a... There was a spawn here at one point. <gasps> oh, that's lovely. I don't lovely. know where... I don't know where she went. She probably got upset that I moved into the cave she was living in. <laughs> she was actually a big fan of her house, and she did not want to share. <laughs> That's actually what happened. She just got a little bit angry. She, when I got here, she was stuck in a waterfall, and I did have to save her. Well, Maybe then she should be less upset house. then, because you saved her. She should be less upset. Oh, I'm running. I've run out of room because I have so many eggs in my pockets. Oh no, <laughs> it's a travesty. Well, nope. I do have a shovel, so I. I'm gathering. Uh, Ooh, dandelions. What's your favorite flower? Uh, lilies. Ah, oh, that's a good one. I'm a, I'm a dandelion fan. Oh, your shovel's so much so much more cool than mine. <laughs> Mine's is just the stone one that I found just now. <laughs> it was just. It was just. Born. But I've got a good 33 dirt, so we're doing great. I got a good 52. Alright, your shovel is cooler than mine, <laughs> objectively. 
and maybe that's on me for not having a better shovel. <laughs> but see what happened was, as I left it at home. There's showing so many flowers. I need to do a little tulip. Yeah, I'm just going to put some things away that I don't need in my pockets right this second. Maybe silk tongue to some grass too. That would probably be smart. Oh, that takes so long. This is so sad. Tragic even. <laughs> Alright. I think I've got a good amount. How do you feel? I've already started wow. filling in the hole. Wow. <laughs> wow. Just left me behind. See how it is? <laughs> I bring you eggs since this is how you treat me. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh. I do bring grass, so that's that's my contribution. I have I have dirt and grass. <laughs> oh your grass shifts in the different colours. Oh you have moss, that's moss. Never mind. I'm silly. Yeah, I added a little bit of moss. Hmm. I like moss. It's a good addition. Don't say my dear. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I'm just building too high up. There we go. Let's make this pitter off a little bit better. There we go. Mm-hmm. I don't know. The block was floating, don't mind that. It's fine, I'm sure. Making just a little home for the chickens. Because I I'm gonna be honest, there's there's like three stacks of eggs, so it could four stacks of eggs, I think. So that could oh, be no. <laughs> that would likely mean so many chickens. Oh yeah. picked up this one torch put you down there more chickens than i'll probably know what to do with i could pet them if you want if You're i get right. another ostrich baby i'll bring that and then you can have a <laughs> you can have an ostrich i you... don't know if i'm ready to be a mother <laughs> <laughs> oh, well i didn't know that i was ready to be a, a grandfather and it just springs up on you <laughs> i lied i have five stacks of eggs i also have several flowers which I'm also going to put down because that feels right. Sometimes yeah. you don't choose parenthood and parenthood change chooses you. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Do you have maybe a piece of... You know what? I'll probably just do like a... There oh, we go. I was gonna... That's why I was about to ask if you had carpet and then I was like, yeah, you don't have to do all that. It's alright. Alright. Do you want a stack to throw as well? Sure. Yeah. Here you go. It's two for you and we'll see how many we get. Oh. 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 Okay. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Two. Oh. Ooh. Oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. That's all my eggs. I'm gonna grab all these shells. Oh, they're everything. all getting into the pocket. <laughs> oh. Come here. Uh. There we go. Oh, there we go. Alright, no more pocket behavior. I only have one <laughs> seed though, so um Uh I have a seed too. Okay, two of you can have seeds. You? There we go. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, and I like they like their little ridge. If you wanted to, you could carve into that a little bit and they could have they have a little house in a way. Maybe I could make them a little bit of a waterfall. <gasps> Ooh, Water I'd... feature for the chickens. They would enjoy a good bird bath. Just splash around. Oh, they're so <laughs> cute. They're so little. Oh, I like them. Hi. There we go. Itty bitty. There we go. Oh, the melons have already grown. Look at that. <gasps> Ooh. Melons are so fun. We got, we got, we got new farm things. Gizmo's just staring from over there. <laughs> and chickens. 
Come now, Gizmo, say hi to the chickens. They're delightful. Do you see them, Gizmo? <laughs> he just made eye contact and then started to walk away. Okay. <laughs> Why are you getting a vantage point? <laughs> <laughs> well, that was really that was really nice. <laughs> He is, he, he's, oh, he couldn't take him. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> if I'm going to be a mother, I'm deciding mm. who to be a mother to. <laughs> him. What, what will you name him? Uh. Or her, I don't actually know. It's just chicken. I, uh, I guess it's a chicken, so it's a her and a rooster. All that, but. Do you want to have, do you want to make them a pocket? Probably, yeah. A little, a little area. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know where the little area should be. I'm trying to think where, I mean. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just like a Gizmo? little. Oh, sorry. Oh, no, I Open thought you were going it. outside. Gizmo's fine. He's just, he's just being, he's just feeling silly. Uh -huh. Um, I don't know. Where, where do you think? Uh, I feel like I should make the house bigger. Oh, I no, he's outside. Oh! I didn't mean it. He's so little. I was trying to grab him. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna hold him. You you decide where you want to put him. Uh, I'm holding the chicken. Okay, I've got the second. baby. <laughs> let me let me let me let me let me do something real quick. Please. I've got the baby. <laughs> it's a delightful image I've got here of just me holding this really little chicken. Guess are you seeing this? Oh, hello. Gives me a look at the chicken. <laughs> oh, he's delightful. Making a little area. Mm -hmm. the, the chicken covers my entire face. I can't see past the chicken somehow. I don't know why. <laughs> no. It feels like I should be able to. <laughs> but apparently the chicken uh. gives me where you're going. <laughs> I just see you emerge from the darkness. Hi, bud. <laughs> All right. I'm only seeing baby view. <laughs> oh, okay. I see. I see what you're doing here. Got a little little area. Mm. Uh. <laughs> it's just a little bit funny that I just only see the, the view from from the baby's perspective. <laughs> it is it is com comical how little I see right now. Oh, there's a nest up here. <gasps> oh, that's delightful. Oh, that's cute. I like it, I like it. Oh, they've got a whole little expansion. Have you ever thought of a name already? I like the name Arpeggio. Arpeggio? Mm -hmm. That's a good name. Are you gonna are you gonna place the floor or should I put them down in there? Uh yeah, floor <laughs> Oh, didn't mean to do that. <laughs> That's a good name. You've got a good name. I hope you know that little one. <laughs> you are a fancy little chicken. <laughs> He's just so small. He's just so little. It fits in like one hand. I'm using both to hold it to be extra careful, but it does just fit in one hand. Okay, that should be good. Okay, do you want to put a fence or anything? Uh, oh, right, 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 right. Uh, I gotta just for safety. Good. Small and fluffy, you're so right. <laughs> Real, both small and fluffy. There we go. All right, I'm gonna put you down. Oh, <laughs> that's perfect. That's perfect. Look, look at, look at my new, look at my baby. Oh, they've got a little window to peek out of. Hold on, we can probably see them. <laughs> oh, wait, that's really cute. Aww. Actually, look at the little head peeking. <laughs> Oh, that's that's wonderful. That's delightful. Oh, I love that. Ten out of ten. That is that is that is good. That is a good home. Mm. Yeah, it's been so productive today. More productive than I have been in weeks. That's so fair. I'm glad I could help. Do you want to maybe take a rest though and have some tea? Gizmo, what are yeah. you doing up there? 
Gizmo, get oh. down! <laughs> oh, Gizmo, no! Gizmo, now we talked about this. Gizmo, get down. Gizmo. Are you, are you, what are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, stop this madness. Is he okay? He's alright. I gave him I gave him a treat. He's just being silly. Gizmo, come sit down. You 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 no, you've been silly enough. Good. Here. Yeah. I've got some tea on me. I also didn't make this, but 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 I've even got sugar and honey. Get some tea. Honey and sugar, because I've heard that maybe a little bit of that makes it nicer. I also need to run around a bit so I can actually have this tea. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna do some parkour. I like chickens. <laughs> he smells bright ideas. <laughs> Listen, okay, you're right, but still. I just looked up. I didn't expect it to be ascending the glowberry vines. I just didn't know that that was really something that could do. I honestly forgot I had the glowberry vine there. <laughs> <laughs> Until Gizmo was on it. And then suddenly, <laughs> it was a concern. Didn't previously think it was. I'd like to be hungry now. Thank you. Okay. Mm. I think this was a good day. Ooh. I'm really glad to, got to spend some time with you, Cozy. Thank you. Hmm. Thank Maybe. you for the help. Of course. If you ever need anything from me, I'm I'm typically around and just ring the bell or come on down. <laughs> I'm always happy to be of help. I'll keep that in mind. Hmm. And if I need help naming chickens or doing some gardening, I <laughs> will come to you. <laughs> you. Mm. Shall we just do maybe I don't normally say this. Relax for just a moment with some tea and a good dog and a cute chicken. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lovely day. <laughs> <laughs>